Hey guys, how are we doing? So we are getting there officially. It's it's Tuesday. Uh, I don't even know what time it is honestly. And uh, I have last couple shades for uh, for Jeff for his imps. Did this one for his larger one. I did about 30 Kydex shades in the last three days. All those are getting ready. They are pretty much ready. They just have to be put. The, we just have to put the edges on. The cleaver is done ridiculously sharp, you know, my kind of sharpness. He put the edge on it, I strapped it for him. The steampunk toe imp is getting a uh, getting kydex. I actually got a very cool gift today from uh, Ferrum Forge. Elliot is a very cool guy, <laughs> beautiful knives, and he hooked me up with another piece of SM100, which is awesome. That's, that's really cool <laughs> when you speak of me, speak well. Nemez Zacho, that actually means in Slovakian, you're welcome. He's a really nice guy, very nice guy. Still enjoy his videos because he, he shows some cool stuff and I like him. I, I wish that he would be going to the Blade Show too to meet him. Jeff, Sam are actually doing business cards now because Jeff left it on the last second, so they are pretty busy. He's working on a toe though, so. And let me just show you something, what I think I'm done. There's a couple of little things I have to do, but this is pretty much it. And, uh, wow, it was a lot of work. There you go, guys. Last two months of almost every single three minute I had went into this. And uh, it does make me feel very proud that I did do a lot. Uh, it was fun. It's a lot of work, but you know what? It was worth it. I enjoyed doing it. It, it really had fun, especially the last couple of days. Literally live on the coffee monster and uh, everything pretzels from Wawa, and uh, literally wake up in the morning, go to shop, start working, go back to the house at like midnight. That's how we work last last what four days, but it was fun. It was fun, we're tired, but I enjoyed it, I don't know, I think Jeff is really, like, really tired because he did a lot more work than I do. You know, I did just a little bit of my stuff and uh, tried to help him, did all those Kydex stuff for him, but it was it a was good time for me. Uh, so here are actually five, these five actually Jeff did the handle for me, are my grinds, my finishes, I actually did some really cool stuff, let me show you, check it out. Did some two-tone finishes on a lot of these, you know, like perfect grind lines, perfect line, stone wash on the top, and a really nice sudden finish on the blade. And then Jeff did the Jeff did the handles. This one is really cool. Green black kyrenite, my typical Kydex, you know, pops in really secure and uh, pops out. Some uh, carbon fiber stuff. Unit wow, that really shoots. Unidirectional again with really nice grind lines. What else did we do? Jeff did this one. Man, I'm gonna be chasing those shits everywhere. I like this one a lot. I changed this one a little bit. You know, ground off the belly here and left just the belly up front. It almost looks like a tanto, but it's it's it started off as a tanto, but the way I did actually blended in that edge into the regular belly and I really like this a lot just looks very clean and Jeff did beautiful work on the G10, blue G10 with the rock pattern heavily sandblasted, I did that sandblasting, I really like that I like when it's sandblasted or bead blasted, it gives it that little extra texture and I think it actually looks very cool look at that really nice texture to the G10 so that's that, another one this here Regular carbon fiber, uh, not so heavenly bead blasted, but again, the really nice grinds with the lines, two tone finish. Then there's nice peel ply, very clean peel ply with stone wash. Jared did a little jimping and a full high convex. And these you've seen, all these you've seen, you've seen all those, a lot of work. One thing I, I do want to mention is that we I did raise the prices for the show, and uh, I think generally too because the finishes and uh, and the work, even though with the grinder, 
it is it is more uh, it's easier for me to do but it still takes a longer time because I do end up playing with it a lot longer to get the finishes so some of the, some of the prices are uh, you know went up a little bit uh, not much and also some of them went up kind of a lot but there will it's it is for the show so you guys when you guys gonna stop by you just let me know and you know we work it out definitely my people from YouTube are definitely getting deals but there's a certain way certain kind of like marketing that I kind of have to take into consideration uh, you know to listen to other people to do the smart steps uh, you know when I'm gonna go into the full-time live making which are you know very unfamiliar to me but I I will trust the people who who know what they're talking about so yeah there we go <laughs> such a nice feeling it's like literally looking at my kids it's over 30 knives I think 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 43 knives, that's, that's a lot, and then there are the widget ashes and the little keychains, so that certainly is a lot, I actually have a pretty cool thing for people there, uh, everybody was gonna buy something. You're getting a, you know, kind of like a heavy duty Ziploc with the business card, some stickers, and uh, there's I think 20 something, 25 if I remember right, the, the fridge magnets and stuff like that. So that's gonna be a nice little extra, you know, for the people. So guys, hope you enjoyed it. I really, I am looking forward to meet you all there. It's gonna be blast, or as many as possible, and I really will try to do as as many videos as possible. Because I know I enjoyed it when I, when I wasn't able to go to certain shows and seeing the footage from there. So I would definitely, again, I'll try to do my best, we'll see. But I might be really busy at the table. I might want to really hang out at the table, you know, to talk to the people who come by, by the table. You know, and stuff like that. We'll see how it goes. So guys, take care, stay safe and remember, don't cut yourself.